oh my god is she fast approaching my areola what the hell is going on finally by the time i put them on my ass had swallowed them everybody it's saturday it's eight o'clock the 15th of may um the weather is so bad saturday standard procedure i normally go and train in the park with matthew that's not gonna happen because i'll show you the weather in a minute it's raining wet cold so i have to go to the gym i don't like the gym because you don't get dogs coming to say hi to you you don't get people saying hi to you you don't get the sun, you don't get natural light. You know, park life is for me, but clearly the weather will not let me prosper. So I have to go to the gym. Anyway, in other news, I was editing my other video and I think I was under duress. I just skimmed over the fact that I bought this chair. I will insert a picture. So basically, if you're buying things on eBay, you have your heart, you have to be, you have to have thick skin because if it's a bid and not to buy it now and I think there are people out there whose bidding game is top-notch because the amount of bids I lost before I actually got that one but I'm in love with my chair uh, and it's just to say um, eBay is very heart-wrenching if you like something and it's on bid as opposed to buy it now sometimes most of the time you can buy the items now anyway i'm rambling i will take you guys with me i'll show you the weather it looks so dodgy i'm gonna bang on some music now and then yeah we'll catch up in a I'm, i have to go to town and i don't know it's this is out of my comfort zone basically i don't do the gym shout out to you if you do the gym but i much prefer the park you know, it's chilled out, I can mess about, I can laugh out loud, I can just be myself. The gym is, like, serious. Let's work on our bodies. Anyway, without bashing the gym too much, there's nothing wrong with the gym, it's just not my cup of tea. I'll catch up with you guys later. Bye-bye. Guys, it's so quiet. I think it's because it's 8 o'clock and it's on a Saturday so um, let me show you the dodgy weather <laughs> let me just show you the dodgy weather yeah. the, the reason I am going to the gym <laughs> Okay. That's alright. Yeah.
because it's eight o'clock. It's eight o'clock on a Friday, Friday the 14th of May. Just been to Ikea, you've seen that. I loved those chairs, but then I didn't like the color. They're a bit too bright. I'm looking for a chilled out wood color. I don't know if that even makes sense. Anyway, just been to Ikea, gonna drive back home. I'll obviously show you what I bought. It wasn't much, but I needed a break from the screens, girl. And um, I thought, you know what? Let me come to Ikea, see what's what. Uh, do my um, candle, um, do my candle haul, because God knows when I'll be coming back this way. And then, yeah, show you guys what I'm working with. I wanted a knife and I've gotten one. And um, when I was paying, the girl told me she needed to see my ID because I needed to be over 21. <laughs> gang, 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 gang. <laughs> anyway, um, probably catch up with you guys in the house. I need to, and I'm looking sharp. I'm not looking like my usual skunky self. There's nothing wrong like with looking like a skunk. It is what it is, life. Um, anyway, I'll catch up with you guys later. Hi guys, so a lot of time has passed. It's now um, Wednesday the 19th. It's six o'clock. A lot of time has passed. I last left you guys at Ikea and I was supposed to show you guys a haul. A lot has um, developed. We've done a haul. Oh, look at my hair. Look at my hair. We've done a haul. I will link that down below and I just wanted to quickly show you what I grabbed from Ikea. First of all, I grabbed a knife. I will insert it because it's not here. These things have been sat here so that I can show you guys. Can we just have a quick moment for my hair, wig, whatever you want to call it. I styled it myself. It's still thick as ever. Anyway, I got these lint removers. I think they were 75p. Candle. Uh, uh, oh, right. Candle, I think this is vanilla as usual. I have a thing for candles at the moment. Strawberry. These are peaches. Do you remember that movie? Uh, Face Off. And Nicolas Cage, or was it Nicolas, Nicolas Cage or the other guy? He licked some woman and then he was like, she tastes like peaches. Anyway, we've got that. We've got something. I think this is also vanilla. I, 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 I think I'm going through something with candles. And then more candles. 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 Candles, oi, 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 candle, oi, 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 candle, and another candle. That's all I picked up, and a knife. I had gone there for a colander, and I didn't get the colander I liked. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's six o'clock, I've not eaten. I want to quickly eat, put some clothes away, and then I need to start my fast basically but today has been an extremely productive day i hope you guys are doing really really well look at me not looking like a skunk eh? not looking like a skunk <laughs> anyway i'll catch you guys later good morning everyone um welcome to my channel if you're new here thank you so much for stopping by if you always tune in thank you for that i truly truly appreciate your support today is saturday it's 12 minutes past eight it's the 22nd of may i am going to meet my matthew i'm going to meet matthew in town for a session i've got to go back i've got to go to little home bargains there's somewhere else i need to go I need to grab a colander as well. It's all happening today. I am feeling good. Woke up in a good mood. Slept really well. Edited a video yesterday. I'm on fire, baby. Anyway, I'm running late. So I'll catch up with you guys later.
how are you doing it's friday it's six o'clock it's friday hey it's sunday sunday i know it's saturday then sunday it's friday hey it's friday anyway it's friday the fourth six o'clock in the evening I am going to meet Matthew, my trainer at the gym, purely because Saturday, which is tomorrow when I normally train with him, I am meeting a friend of mine who I have not seen in two, three years. So I'm really, really excited about that. We are going for lunch together. And then Sunday, it's spa day. Woo! We're going to St. David's. We're going to have swimming. I've booked in a sea salt scrub and um, neck and back and body massage, something along those lines. We're going, a group of us. Then after that, cocktails, baby. I'm gonna drink my one cocktail and then I'll get, I'm gonna get drunk. I'm very excited, very, very excited. So that's the plan of action. I have to show you guys my outfit. I'm wearing this vest Miles got me nearly 10 years ago. I think it seems to be a thing for me. Um, yeah, so let's get to the gym and then I'll model for you my workout gear. Yeah, and I think I'm cramping. My period is on its way. But that's not going to put a damper in my spirits. I'm going to show you what I'm, I'm about to eat because it's hot. Fruit pastels, lol, ice lolly. Life is good. Top primer gift from Miles from... Hi guys, I'm finally in Newport. People are looking at me, but I'm finally in Newport. I'm meeting my friend for lunch. We're gonna eat at Nando's. She's, got, she's five minutes behind and I'm really looking forward to, to having some food. And I've not seen her in like nearly two years. So I'm really, really, really excited. I'll show you guys my outfit later. So yeah, I might show you my food. Good afternoon, everybody. It's now Saturday, four o'clock. It's the 5th of June. I just had a meal with my friend. I hadn't seen her for a long time. Uh, we really, really had a good chat. It was good catching up with her. Then I have shot some content. 
and then I took her to get her piercing on her ear and I got this nose ring I really really like it it looks like that anyway Yesterday I had my session with Matthew. It was amazing. Maybe it may be a Friday evening thing. I don't know. But I was really tired because I did my morning session. Tomorrow I'm going for spa day. Um, Arlo, I booked in Arlo for a play date at the trampoline. He's going with Miles. And then us guys are going to the St. David's Hotel. If I can film, I will do my best to film. But the friends I'm going with. I don't normally like whack my camera in front of them so I might if I catch some snippets I I will share with you guys yeah and um, I've just I seem like I've ticked a lot of to-do lists on my list I've gotten my phone battery changed I have waxed I I've just bang 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 I'm feeling very efficient at the moment so anyway it's now four o'clock, as, as I said. Um, I'll be shooting off to go and pick up Arlo. He's at uh, his nephew's place. They're playing. And then back to the house. I'm feeling very stimulated. All those people, all those things. It, it was an amazing day, but it's time for me to crawl back into my hole, relax with the boys, and just, just take it steady. I might even treat myself to a shower because this makeup needs to come off and... Yeah, I'm just rumbling. I feel good. I've had, I'm having a lovely weekend so far. It is hot, like a melting pot, which is really, really good. Yeah, and I just thought this dress, I got this dress from ASOS. It just, it's a long maxi black dress. It covers all the sins, trials and tribulations that you've had in your life. Yeah, so that's my plan. Oh, I did my nails as well. I don't know if you'll be able to see that. I don't know. I, I don't know how to model nails. I'll show you what I used, but I'm feeling very positive. The tiredness is starting to creep in because it's becoming light super early. And today I was up at five o'clock like ding. Maybe it was excitement to see my friends, but also it gets light bright quite early. Anyway, I've been rambling for three minutes. Ah, guys, my six monthly checkup is coming up. It's due to come in July. So I've got a tracker that I normally measure, consistency, fasting, uh, enjoyment, nothing to do with weight loss or anything like that. It's just some, some things I've set up for myself that I need to check every six months to see if I'm doing them and I'm doing them as consistently as I should be doing them. So there's that. Kitchen is starting on the 14th. There's a not wall being knocked down. Radiators being moved and changed, doors being moved and changed. It's just going to be like a proper construction site. Um, yeah. I'm very, very excited about this month. I don't know if travel will even be an option because now Port uh, Portugal has been removed from the green list, which is disheartening. You don't want to be on holiday and then you're worrying about if the next few days your country is being moved to from one traffic system uh, light to another anyway maybe travel is for 2022 and not 2021 i don't know but in the meantime we can enjoy the country there are loads of places to visit i'm thinking of london anyway i'm rambling so much i hope you guys are doing well i'll catch up with you later let me go pick my son and open the windows because it is baking in this car and i've been shooting content anyway I'll catch up with you guys later. Bye. Oh, look at the lighting in here. Eh? Good morning, everybody. Today is Sunday, the 6th of June. It is now 10 to 11. I'm having a spa day crisis situation. Trying to check if my swimsuits from two years ago will fit. Arlo is busy building Lego. Do you want to say hi, Arlo? Hi. Can I show them what you've built so far? White. Give me that one, I show them. Look at this, this one. Yeah. Arlo has built this so far. We will show you the picture later if it allows me. Okay, Arlo? Shower. All right, so I've got to try some swimsuits, then shower, then make a start. Anyway, I hope you guys are having a good day. My skin is feeling raw. I'll talk to you about that later.
But let me let me get things going. Let me get things maybe going. Maybe if you go to a spa. Yeah, maybe they'll do something about my peeling skin. But yeah, let's let's crack on. Hi guys, I have laid everything out on the bed. So I'll start with the bag. I featured this on my haul. I got this from Amazon. I'm using this. I know it's a shopping bag, but um, it's lined in plastic inside. So if my swimsuit gets wet, I'm not worried about it damaging my bag. Then we've got the hand gel from Primark. It smells of sweet macaroon. Walida moisturizer. I cannot recommend this enough. And then SPF La Roche-Posay. It doesn't give you a white cast. Then you've got my Dior perfume, Brazilian Crush. That smells absolutely divine. I got this body butter from Home Bargains. It smells absolutely amazing. Um, I've got my deodorant and then I've got uh, body wash. I want to finish off that shampoo. Sunglasses. I got these sandals from Max and Spencer years ago. My friend Big Mike got them for me. I'm going to put them all in this bag that I got from H&M years and years and years ago. I've got my swimsuits. I've, this is a swimsuit. This is a bikini. Depending on which one fits me better, I'll decide. And then I've got my headscarf that I bought nearly 15 years ago. And that's pretty much it. I forgot to mention, this is actually a lesso. This is from my friend Patricia. Shout out to my friend Patricia for getting me a lesso. That's my color palette. But it says Subira Hutuliza Moyo. This is like patience um, settles the heart or something to that effect. Correct me if I'm wrong if you're good at Swahili. Although saying that, I did have a B plus in Swahili in high school. So there we are. Yeah. No, no, I won't. I won't. I won't. Good fit. I'm going to catch you guys later. I'm running late. <laughs>
evening everybody it's a week later today is saturday the 12th it's around seven o'clock i'm editing this video so it's been a week since i last saw you guys uh, i wanted to come and end the vlog and just say the treatments were absolutely insane very relaxing strongly recommend very clean and very professional i'm a bit of a prude so when um when she was giving me when she was doing the massage she obviously gave me some temporary knickers and they were like this tiny by the time i put them on my ass had swallowed them and then uh, when she was doing because it's a full body sea salt scrub um she had to do my boobs and then i was just because i'm such a prude i was just thinking oh my god is she fast approaching my areola what the hell is going on but she was so professional she made me feel relaxed and then i chilled out about it then after that was uh neck back and neck shoulder and back massage and you can request the amount of pressure you'd like i wanted a firm one because i work out quite a lot and she did a magnificent job i will leave her name on the screen of the lady i i did and we had a chat um i would absolutely recommend if if holiday option is not one for you this year i would strongly recommend doing a spa it doesn't have to be that spa although i do have to say their cleanliness was top form it wasn't very busy me and my friends felt so relaxed and um, there was a lot to do sauna jacuzzi pool it was just quite a lot to take in i was heavily stimulated that weekend and after that we had really good cocktails and had a dance and it was absolutely awesome um i'll end the vlog here because i'm rambling now too much i'll catch up with you guys because my next one is a reno vlog so if you want to keep up to date with me uh on the regs instagram is your place to get in touch with me i post there daily stories anyway and um, I'll catch up with you in my next video. Follow me on Instagram, like the video, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the spa and everything else that I shot that whole month. And I'll catch up with you soon. Bye-bye.